finally got some half decent snow. I'm heading to the train station now, so I don't know if it will actually show up. If it does, I got roughly another 10 minutes. So I'm almost there, kind of just taking my sweet time. Oh, looks like somebody else was here before uh, snow got too deep. Fun fact, uh, I think one of the first time the lady like, really saw snowfall, <laughs> she went right to bed. She was like, nope, nope, it's snowing. White stuff's falling from the sky. I'm going to go right to bed. Uh, so, luckily enough, stuff's covered in snow where I'm not going to really give away my location. And I always figured that was something important. I was taught that as a kid. Just never give away your location on the internet. Because like every profile I have, I never use my real name. I never use the real uh, city that I'm in or town. Or, you know, it's usually somewhere in the tri-state area of where I'm at. Like. It's just a personal preference to, because you never know with people out there. And I've had enough weirdos and stalkers. Granted, some of them lived in the same state, but that's a whole other story. Yeah. I used to do open mic night at comedy clubs. And I had a story about a stalker. And ironically, she... She actually worked nearby the comedy club. Um, she worked at like a Burger King. And she stalked me for about six months. And I, I was writing a whole bit about it. I forget most of it. I got it written down somewhere. But, you know, she did, she did a lot of stuff. Like she gave me a fake name and all that other crap. And... I was writing a whole bit about it. I just haven't had the time since I've had Lady to really go back and perform open mic night. Um, so that's why I was thinking if I started a second, like, if I actually started, like, a legitimate YouTube channel where I was going to try to make money off it, I figured I would just upload stand-up bits, you know, audio files, and... Either just share stories, clips, voice acting reels, things like that. And because it helps, you know, get the ideas out. And it helps me a lot more with public speaking. Like even since I started doing this channel, and where I'm talking more on camera, it helps me a lot more with talking, you know, trying to, uh, articulate what I really want to say. So, I'm just gonna, like this video went on a bit longer than I meant to, but just kinda enjoying the snow, documenting it. We actually got some like, actual snow. I just don't know when the, if the train's gonna show or if I'm gonna have to order a lift tonight. So I've had some time. Yeah. This parking lot has a habit of flooding. Thanks to the river over here. I don't want to walk too far because it's just going to be snow and mud. like about being the area I'm at. It's like you got the city, but you kind of got like this hill, hilly area too, you know, so 
I don't know. Kind of has that nice old colonial feel to some parts of it. So. So I'm just going to end the video here.